A big weekend ahead in the capital city as Ringling Brothers and Barnum and Bailey Circus makes one final stop in Providence. The show coming to a close after 146 years and we got a behind the scenes look at the greatest show on earth ahead of their final farewell performance. I would assume supporter Steph Machado is in our newsroom now with the details. Steph. Well, everyone I met today made sure to remind me that this show is older than baseball, an American tradition that's declined in popularity over time. And all the performers I met today were in great spirits just getting ready for a bittersweet ending. Jugglers and contortionists and clowns. This is close enough. All preparing for their final show. I'm third generation. This mother and son juggling duo has been living on the circus train for 18 years. We are, we are savoring now this last moment. The performers I met today are on one of two tours. This tour has its final show on Sunday at the Duncan Providence. The Ringling Brothers Barnum and Bailey Circus will go away completely at the end of May. I personally was pretty devastated when we heard the news. These clowns passing on some skills to me before they go. Tell, ladies and gentlemen. Very nice. They tell me they will keep performing elsewhere. Wherever we move to, it's going to seem like a mansion compared to my room on the train. But there's nothing like the circus. I've wanted this my entire life. I've wanted this since I was three years old, yeah. and I get to be here at this historical moment of the greatest show on earth. It just wasn't sustainable anymore. Company spokesperson Stephen Payne says the tough decision was made after ticket sales declined over time, then plummeted after the circus stopped using elephants last year, the final elephant show in Providence. We knew ticket sales would take a hit from that, but it was much greater than we ever anticipated. Payne says the 50 or so animals in the circus have all been placed in new homes, such as sanctuaries or with private owners. Some, like these dancing poodles, will stay with their performers. After Sunday, the Circus Extreme Tour will be over and it'll be on to new adventures for these performers. I'm going to take a long nap. And there are still tickets available for Sunday's show at the Dunkin' Donuts Center. Again, that's the very last show for this group of performers you just saw. There is a second tour going on that will finish up in Long Island at the end of May, and that will be the official end of the Ringling Brothers Barnum & Bailey Circus. Live in the newsroom, I'm Steph Machado, Eyewitness News.